Hello everybody, it's Explore Vegas, and today we are at the Circus Circus Hotel and Casino in Las Vegas. We're hitting you up with another buffet review. The buffet at Circus Circus seemed to open fairly quietly after the pandemic, and while the hotel keeps it open, they also keep it a pretty big mystery. Just scanning Circus Circus's website, all the restaurants have a learn more tab except for the buffet. It's as if they don't want you to know the hours or the prices. Kind of strange, huh? Luckily, we have the current scoop on hours and pricing. It's open Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, from 7 a.m. to 2 p.m. for brunch, and Friday and Saturday evening from 4.30 to 10 for dinner. This is no longer a cheap eats buffet. Currently, the dinner is $32.99 per adult, $24.99 per child 4 to 10, and it's still free for children 3 and under. Was eating here a giant Las Vegas gamble? You'll just have to keep watching to find out. Sit back, relax, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and let us show you all the dishes in this mystery buffet. Let's start this tour with the Italian dishes. First up, chicken parmesan, Italian sausage, here's penne pasta with marinara sauce and alfredo sauce, spaghetti and meatballs, stuffed shells, Here's some Parmesan cheese, shrimp scampi, here's a seafood cioppino, fried shrimp, now we'll look at the Latin dishes, baked fish with salsa verde, paella, here's some hard taco shells, flour tortillas and jalapeno, Here's taco meat, chicken machaca, Spanish rice and refried beans, chicken tamales, there's red salsa and green salsa. Somebody dribbled some salsa out of the steam tray. Here's your lemons and your other items for your tacos. Here's your au jus sauce, which only means we're about to see the carving station. Wow, look at them carve. The carving station offers roast beef, pork ribs, and there's a giant ham. Here's the star of the buffet. It's the mustard and ketchup station. Just kidding. Here's your gravy and your other condiments for the meat. Here's some butter, cheese, and salsa. Here's your assorted rolls. Don't eat the bread. Here's mashed potatoes, turkey gravy, and brown gravy. Here's rice pilaf and beef stew. Baked chicken. Some au gratin potatoes. Here's corn on the cob. And fried chicken. Here's a corn casserole. Here's baked beans. Yep, let's get into it. Here's some cornbread. This kind of resembles a kid's section. Here you got waffles and syrup. Fried chicken tenders. Some corn dogs. Here's mac and cheese, and mixed vegetables. And now a look at the soups. Here's minestrone. And chicken noodle. Wolf down some crackers if you like. Don't eat the bread. Here's oil and vinegar. Some croutons. There's a Caesar salad and a tossed salad mix. The beets, ich. Onions, cucumbers, cherry tomatoes, olives, and mushrooms. For dressings, there's French, Thousand Island, ranch, blue cheese, Italian, and low fat ranch. There's some hard boiled eggs and shredded cheese. 
Parmesan cheese, potato salad, caprese salad, there's coleslaw, some granola, some canned diced peaches, some yogurt, some canned mixed fruit cocktail, strawberry yogurt, some canned pears, cottage cheese, some cantaloupe, and honeydew. Those are fresh cut. Here's some more rolls. Don't eat the bread. Now let's look at some desserts. These are the no sugar added items. You see some pies and carrot cake. There's a cheesecake. Scrumptious. Some pudding. Here are some of the regular items. I see a lemon meringue pie and then a vanilla cake with chocolate frosting. That's just a chocolate cake. The moment you've been waiting for, green jello. Not. There's apple pie, cheesecake, carrot cake, some cannolis. Here's some brownies. My goodness, one of them has a dent in it. There's carrot cake. Assorted muffins. Some toppings for your ice cream. Which could only mean, there's your soft serve ice cream. This machine is unlabeled, but the other one has chocolate and vanilla soft serve. Grab a cone for your ice cream or put it in a bowl if you like. They have caramel and fudge sauce. I know you're going to be excited about this. Take a look. It's a cereal station. That's just what you wanted for dinner. And of course, your cereal is nothing without whole milk, so there you go. At this buffet, you get your own drinks. They have soft drinks, juice, coffee, tea, and of course, honey, sugar packets, Blenda, creamers, all that good stuff. All right, we're getting hungry. Time to go grab some food. Let's go see what they have to eat. Piece of chicken farm. Ooh, here we go. We got some pasta and shrimp. There's a little seafood chapino. With a nice little mix. Had a corn dog in ages. I guess when at the circus buffet do it. First plate here at Circus Circus Buffet. Is this a risk or is it gonna pay off? Let's see. I had a little bit of seafood chapino, there's some linguine and shrimp, uh, some chicken parmesan, and, and how about this? I haven't had a corn dog since I was like 10 years old, so I'm gonna try one of those. Well, let's get into this shrimp first. I like the shrimp in here because it's peeled already and nobody makes me peel my own shrimp, so let's see. It's shrimp. Nothing special, but not bad. Pasta is really creamy, even a little spicy too. Looks like they put some pepper or something else in there. Let's try the chicken parm. Looks like a lot of chicken and not so much parm, this piece I got here, but I didn't want to dig for a piece in the middle, so. I just went with one on the top. 
It's all right. It definitely needs a little more sauce and cheese, though. I think if it had that, it would be all right. The chicken is about right for it. Just need a little more of that. There's some seafood chapino here. So it's got like some mussels and clams. Here, we'll get a little clam in here and give it a whirl. It's all right. Let's try this corn dog. All right, here we go. The adult version of me trying this sucker out. Tastes like a hot dog with pancake around it. Tastes all right, though. Oh, look, I have some chicken noodle soup and the seafood. And I don't know what is this. Tamale. Tamale. Always see it in every buffet. Woo! Look at that. Right. So what inside? It look like. Oh, look at this. It's chicken inside. I think chicken and beans. Let me try. Mmm, tastes good. Tastes very good. You thought about it for a minute. You weren't sure. Yeah. It's good. <laughs> Yeah. All right. I thought it's dessert, but <laughs> it's not dessert. And you know, I'm so happy here. They have jalapeno. <laughs> oh wow! Ooh, my jalapeno. I love it. Did you get the big one? Yeah, I picked the big one out of all of them. <laughs> <laughs> mm. You're a Why heck of a gal. You eat all that jalapeno. <laughs> Let me try the chicken noodle soup. They are hot. Hot soup. <laughs> yeah, I take all the hot plate. <laughs> hot uh, food. I see. Mmm. This is look like slow cooked chicken noodle soup. Mmm. I don't need to chew. It just melt in my mouth. Yeah, what Junior's doing with his chicken. Ah, this is a kid. This is a kid buffet. He love it. It's the circus circus buffet. This is it's so funny. He take the corn dog and he look interested on it. And until he bite, he see the inside and he like nope. 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 He said get rid of that right now. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't want it. The chicken's okay. The fried chicken. Yeah. Yep. All right. Good job, Junior. We are gonna visit the carvery. Get some roast beef and a rib. Thank you. Just wanna get some roast beef and a rib. Thank you. Perfect, thank you. I hit up the carving station, got myself some roast beef, there's a rib I think Mrs. Explore Vegas is going to just dive into later, and then there's some mashed potatoes and chicken. Let's try out the roast beef. It actually looks okay, it doesn't look like it's dried out or anything like that. I'm going to get some au jus they had up there in a minute, but I want to try it without. It's not dry. It's I would just say it's fair. Roast beef is fair. Not bad. Get some mashed potatoes. Always like to get a little of that in when I get a chance. This one's kind of nice with the potato skins in it. Yeah. Mashed potatoes are really nice. We'll get a little piece of chicken. I got the chicken breasts. Baked chicken's pretty good actually. It might be one of the better items here. These pork rib have a lot of seasoning on it. Look. Whoa. I think it's gonna be so juicy and taste so good. Mmm. Mmm. Soft. Delicious. Mmm. Mmm. This is 
the best pork rib. Really? Mmm. It tastes so good. Yeah, good. It's a lot of meat on it. Not too much fat. Nice. It's so worth it. Some final thoughts on the dinner buffet at Circus Circus. They had a decent variety of food, only a few seafood options, but that was to be expected for the $32.99 price tag. Overall, the buffet was decent, but I felt like it could be better. A few adjustments could really help. The buffet had customers, but it wasn't very busy. Perhaps updating their website with hours and pricing might bring more customers. With more customers, they would need to replenish dishes more often. The food was kept warm, but you could see many dishes were sitting a while. I was happy to see and try chicken parmesan. It definitely could have used more cheese and sauce than it wouldn't have looked and tasted so dry. Just the minor adjustment would go a long way. The carving stage was nice and appropriate for the price, but put those meats on the carving board. The poor guy was struggling to carve it with the current setup. At the dessert station, get rid of the pre-portioned cups of pudding and green jello. They don't look appealing. My overall impression is that the food was decent, but could easily be better. So we said this was the ultimate Las Vegas gamble? Well, Unfortunately, we didn't hit the jackpot, but our bellies were full. If you're looking for another budget-friendly buffet option, this could be the buffet for you. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment, because the more you do that, the more YouTube will show our videos to new viewers. And remember, it's always a good day to explore Vegas.